Hi guys, I'm Dr. G.L. Johnson and today we're going to be talking about uh, headaches. Yes, headaches of all different kinds. You know, I wrote in my book over 20 years ago uh, a whole section in my book called Common Sense Health. That, that's the name of the book, Common Sense Health. I wrote that book and I, I talked about all kinds of headaches in that book. How to over, how, how you can overcome these headaches and, and why these headaches are happening. I wrote quite a bit in the book on, on in my book, Common Sense Health, on how to conquer headaches. And I know that there are literally hundreds of thousands of people all over the world, no matter where I am. I mean, there are people out there that suffer with severe headaches. Their lives, in many, in many cases, uh, most people that have severe headaches, they don't have much of a life because they're struggling with this headache all the time, severe pain. And many of them are, have become recluses because because of these headaches that they have. So we're going to discuss the headaches today. So I want you to get your pencils and your paper out. And for those of you out there who don't know me, I'm Dr. J.L. Johnson. I'm a licensed nutritional herbal doctor, licensed and, and a life coach. And I'm, uh, and, and I am, uh, I'm a master herbalist trained in most of the herbologies in Chinese, Japanese, American, and also with a PhD in nutrition and with over 40 years experience. That's four decades of helping people all across this country and the many other countries out there where we do business. Also, I want you to know that I'm one of the world's leading herbal nutritional doctors and that our company, the Aloe Man Incorporated, is also the largest African-American owned health product company and health product company of its kind anywhere in the world. We have over 1,000 herbal formulations in order to help you with just about any kind of problem that you might have. It, it, it doesn't matter what it is. Whether or not they call it AIDS or cancer, MS, epilepsy, leukemia, Parkinson's disease or lupus or sarcoidosis, or whether or not they call it high blood, high sugar, high cholesterol, poor circulation, or even if your feet hurt, you can use God's herbs in order to help your bodies to heal itself. It's biblical. Right there in your Bible, the good Lord has told us that he has given us every green herb for the healing of the nation. And to you, it shall be me. Could it be that you're not getting well because you're not obeying God? Could it be that you're not obeying what God has told us to use in order to help our bodies to heal itself? You know, it's amazing. Today, uh, millions of people, in fact, billions, there's over $60 billion that now is being spent yearly on herbal formulas. People are, people are, are turning back to herbs in groves because they find that the chemical drugs, drugs are doing them more harm that, than good and that they're not working. So, um, so people are turning to chemical drugs. You know, um, uh, the, the, our, the, the, you know, the good Lord took his time to put over 200,000 herbs on this earth to help our bodies to heal itself. Can you imagine that? Over 200,000 herbs. And he put another 9,000 of these herbs in the ocean just to help our bodies to heal itself. And then he gave the knowledge to people like myself, and I thank God for that, that can give you the knowledge that you need to, to use those herbs in the proper manner, in the proper way to help your bodies to heal itself. You see, here, here's a secret that you may not know about. God locked the, the, the miracles in the herbs. The miracles of healing is locked in the herbs. And when you take the proper amount of herbs and, and, and you put it into the body, in, 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 the, in the proper decoction, you put it into the body, the body will unlock the secrets that's in those herbs and take what it needs to heal itself. That's the way it works. And that's the way it's supposed to work. Your body <laughs> needs vitamins, minerals, and nutrients in order to heal, in order to get well. And that's what's in the herbs. That's why drugs cannot help you to heal because they do not have vitamins, minerals, and nutrients. So you need herbs that have vitamins, minerals, and nutrients that can feed the heart, feed the lungs, feed the, 
the, the, all of the organs of the body so that they can heal themselves. You see, this body was designed to save your life and the body heals itself. All we can do is give the body what it needs so that the body can heal itself. And that's what it's all about. So let's get into today's show. We're, and we're talking about headaches today. If you're just joining us, we're talking about headaches. So first, you know, I wrote all about different kinds of headaches. Um, but if you, uh, the number one underlying cause for, and I said my phone there are ringing off the hook. And incidentally, you can call me too. And remember, we will answer your call. You can call me personally by dialing 305-778. 0970. If you're looking for a life coach, someone that can really help you with, uh, to, uh, to get your life back on course, along with getting your health back on course, then you need to call me at 305-778-0970. And if I can't answer you right then, I promise you, I'll call you back and give you the information that you need in order to help your body to heal itself. Now, let's get into this headache thing. Why do so many people have headaches? Well, here's the thing that you've got to understand. First of all, the stomach controls the head. In most cases, the stomach controls the head. So in most people that have headaches, they are, they're doing something to their stomach that's producing the headache. In most cases, it is too much heat that's in the stomach that's causing the problem. So those people that eat a lot of hot sauce, uh, 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 spicy foods and those kind of things, they drink, they do things like drink sodas on an empty stomach or orange juice on it. Did you know that when you drink a soda on an empty stomach, that soda is acid, pure acid, and it can burn the lining of the stomach producing a headache. Orange juice can also do the same thing and therefore call, trigger a headache in your body. So if you're one of those people that do this all the time, you have a habit of getting up. In fact, you know that most people are sick because of bad habits. Yes, bad habits. Bad habits like drinking a soda first thing in the morning before you put anything else in your stomach. No, you should be drinking four ounces of, 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 of clean water, natural mineral water to flush the poison out of the stomach. Um, but when you put orange juice in the stomach, you're going to burn the lining of that stomach or irritate it, cause inflammation, and thereby trigger a headache. And remember, too, the stomach controls the mouth. So when, when that heat flushes up, it can cause problems in the mouth also. Yeah, sore gums, uh, toothaches, uh, uh, tooth decay. All of these things can happen because of all of this heat that's in the stomach, burning lips, uh, 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 sores in the mouth. All these things normally come from what you do to your stomach. So number one is your digestive system. Your, your indigestion, your, your, your poor digestion are the major causes of, of a headache. So that's the first place you want to look. Am I doing these things to my stomach? Am I drinking a soda? Am I drinking coffee on an empty stomach early in the morning, burning my stomach? Do I do that every day and burn the lining of my stomach, thereby triggering headaches? That, that's going to be, yeah, that's, you can do that. And then now here's, here's something else you need to take a look at. When you do that, mix the wrong foods together, you can also trigger headaches. Yes, like mixing fruits and vegetables, uh, that can be a, a very, uh, that can be a problem. Drinking cold water before you eat, that can be a problem also. So, um, so uh, because your food may not digest properly, uh, because because of the coldness that you, you put into the stomach. And, and you've got to be careful. You don't want to put in your stomach something that is too hot or too cold. Remember that. Too hot or too cold can trigger all kinds of stomach problems. Number two, for women only. Now, I wrote in here, uh, if, if you're a woman out there that ever had an abortion or you have to take birth control pills or you, you have menstrual cramps and you, uh, you get aches and and with your with your cycles and this kind of thing, uh, those things can trigger headaches if your cycle is off. And most of the time, the woman's cycle is off because she's eating too, the wrong kinds of food, drinking too much fluid, so the wrong kinds of fluid. That will throw the cycle off. It is not hormones in the most case. It's most of the time what you eat and what you drink that's causing this problem. So females can trigger, have headaches also. 
Um, that, there's no question about it. You can trigger a headache before the cycle or during the cycle. Many women will have headaches. Number three, uh, headache sufferers, those people that have uh, high blood pressure. How you can have a high blood pressure headache, you can have a, a high sugar headache, you can have all, any of these kinds of things can trigger headaches also. Um, when we also talk about uh, kidney and pancreas, adrenals, uh, reproductive organs, and the bladder, when you overwork the kidneys, you can also trigger a headache. Yes, if you're drinking all of that fluid all the time, if you're drinking eight, I mean, if you're drinking a gallon of water a day, uh, 64 ounces or whatever, that then you're going to overwork your kidneys. When you overwork the kidneys, you can trigger a headache. There's no question about that. So remember that. The frequent urination can trigger a headache. Yes, it can. Why? Because you're losing all of those minerals that's going out of your body, thereby you're, you're depleting the body of the necessary vitamins, minerals, and nutrients that you need in order to, for, your or, for your organs and your body to function on a regular basis. So that is something that you've got to take a look at. Um, and, and there's also many other causes of headaches. And they give them fancy names like uh, migraine headaches or um, uh, they'll, they'll, they'll call them other names about out there of kinds of headaches. But in most cases, it's being it, the person is producing the headache themselves by what they do to their stomach or what they're doing to their bodies. So ask yourself the questions, what are you doing to your body in order to trigger this headache? Now, if you've tried everything, I want to tell you about one of the best support products for the stomach and thereby one of the best products I know for those people that may have headaches is our formula number J. 604. Write that down. J604. It supports the body and maintaining good digestion function. And, and as a result of that, it also supports those people that may have headaches. It supports uh, those people that may have headaches. So you want to get J604. J604. And of course, you want to get our vitamin C, what we call Mega C. Mega C. And you want to get our product called the Body Healer. Those three will go. The body healer is one of those tonic formulas that I made that could coax the, coat the lining of the stomach and help you to rebuild the lining of the stomach after you burned it with those sodas and coffee and tea and orange juice and alcohol and those kind of things and, and spicy foods. When you do that, then you need to rebuild the lining of the stomach. So the body healer would be appropriate and be one of the best supports for, for your body to help, help the body to rebuild that lining of the stomach. So today we've been talking about headaches. And if you're one of those people out there that suffer severely with headaches, doesn't matter what they call it. You want to get uh, one of the best support products for the digestive system is going to be J604. You want to get our product called Mega C. Mega C. That's a, uh, one of the best vitamin C's that I know of on the market out today with large amounts of bioflavonoids that can support the, the ascorbic acid and working better. And also, you want to get the body healer. So go to our website at alloman.com. That's alloman.com. Go there. And also, don't, don't leave the site without going to our section on health concerns. That's where you learn where you can, you can choose your own special tea for whatever part of the body that you need it for. So go to health concerns on our website. Also, I want you to visit me on Facebook. And, and yeah, yeah, Facebook and, and the other uh, medias out there and listen to me on radio, wherever you can find me. So do that. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Health Talk and I'm Dr. J.L. Johnson. And as always, we give praise to Almighty God. We hope that you praise him and we say, God bless you all.